Hello everyone, welcome back. Today, we're going to be talking about the type combinations that are missing in Genshin Impact. Did you know Genshin is a lot like Pokemon in which each character in Genshin Impact has two typings, one being their elemental vision type and the second being their weapon type. And today we're going to take a look at which of those combinations are missing and which one of them is the most popular. I was inspired by our previous video to make yet another table to help identify all these missing type combinations and get some interesting facts to share with you guys towards the end of the video. Now let's take a look at those results and let's get right into the video. Immediately to start, there are three type combinations that don't exist within the game. Those being a Hydro Claymore, a Cryo Catalyst, and a Dendro Claymore character. Now this is speculating that the upcoming character Mika is going to be a pull arm user, as that is based on the current rumors that are going around surrounding that character. If he does end up being a Catalyst, well, then we have a Cryo Catalyst and we're still missing a Hydro and Dendro Claymore character. The most popular type combination is actually Cryo Sword characters, in which we have four of them. Those being Kaya, Ayaka, Layla, and Chichi. That's one character from every region that currently exists in Genshin Impact. Excluding Dendro characters, the least popular combinations in Genshin is that of an Animo Claymore, an Animo Polearm, a Geo Bow, and Hydro Polearm users. Each of those categories only having one character that uses that type combination. Those characters being Sayu, Zhao, Goro, and Candice. This table also shows how many characters there are in each respective category, with Cryo being the most popular element having 12 characters, Geo being the least popular element having 7, excluding Dendro again, and the most popular weapon types being Sword and Bow both tied with 14 characters, and Claymore being the least popular with 11 characters. Now what about the sexes of the Genshin Impact characters in regards to their element and weapon combo. In Genshin Impact, we have female and male characters each holding a weapon and elemental type. Here are the ones that are missing. For the sword category, we're missing female Dendro, female Geo, and male Electro. For the Claymore category, we're missing male Animo, and then Hydro and Dendro for both. For the Catalyst category, we're missing Cryo for both, and then a male for any element other than Animo. For the Bow category, we're missing male Cryo, male Pyro, male Electro, and female Geo characters. And for the Polearm category, we're missing female Animo, male Hydro, and male Dendro characters. With these stats being shown, which character combination do you guys expect to come out next with the release of Fontaine, or maybe even a new character before Fontaine? I personally am hoping for a Hydro Claymore user. I love Claymore characters, and it's kind of sad not to see that we don't have a Hydro one yet, so hopefully the Hydro region will answer that blank spot. But with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, as we have a goal to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2023. And for those who have watched up to this point, my apologies for the short videos that have come out recently. I've just been really busy with the school semester, and I wanted to get something that I thought was interesting and very fun to do out for you guys. So I hope you did enjoy, and with that being said, I will catch you all later. So long, everybody.